Hi viewers, welcome to my channel. Hope you have a wonderful day. Today's tutorial is going to be based on how to cut a turtle neck cow caftan with a bowl around the neck using two and a half of chiffon fabric with half yard of satin fabric. This particular plane is the one that is going to stay around the neck like a bow. The difference between this cow caftan and the other one that I've done is that this particular one is a turtle neck cow caftan with a bow. And those ones, I have an up shoulder cow caftan and normal, normal neck cow caftan. So this one is uh, just neck out after. So that's what I'm going to cut out now, which is different from others. So the measurements for this cow caftan are as follows. We have the neck, length of the neck, we have the length and the hips, how tight you want your hips to be. So now I'm going to fold this into four, keeping this aside first. Then folding this into four. So this is into two. Now into four. You can see it. This is into four. Now this is into four. So for the measurement, the length I'm using here, I'm using 57 inches for the length. The core, I'm using uh, 18 inches for the length of the neck, which is the top two parts. So the core part, I'm using 30. Where the core will start from the up and it's going to end at 30 inches. Yeah? The core part is going to stop at 30 inches. So the length that I said earlier, I said 57 inches for the length. So with the sewing allowance, which is different as seam allowance, I'm using 57 and a half. So that is it. So from this particular area, this inches, which is 23 and a half inches, will be the sleeve, uh, the longest of the sleeve from the, from the neck. So I'm going to slant it. I'm going to do a small slanting here from here the shoulder is not a straight shoulder because it's just a small slanting from here so after that don't forget I said this is my this is where the core aspect of it that is going to, this is where it's going to stop so from here i'm going to measure 11 inches my 11 inches 11 inches into four that's 44 inches so with the same allowance i'm making it 11 and a half inches so here is it so this is the, where this is the let's say this is how wide you want the the other part to be apart from the core part so from here now i'm going to make a round curve a round curve like this Don't mind the chalk, it's a white chalk, so when I cut it, you will see where I sketch out. So now I'll cut it for you to see. I'm stopping here. 
this is why I, then I'll cut it down. You can make it this you can make it straight if you want and you can make it like a like a line if you want it also So it remains the turtle neck part. For the turtle neck part, I'm using three and a half for the wideness and three and a half for the deepness. So three and a half to three and a half give us four and a half inches. So four and a half inches into four. That will be 18 inches, like I said earlier. So cutting it out. There is it. This is for the turtle neck. You can see it. You can see the shoulder. You can see the core part and the down part. And this is the turtle neck. So I'm going to keep this aside. Then I'm going to cut the whole part with this fabric for the bow with a standing collar this is what i'm using folding this into two this is into two then into four this is into four so it it depends on how long you want it to be this is 23 and a half inches so you can make it 30 or 15 or any length you want it to be the earnings of the neck is 18 so using 9 9 into 2 this is that will give us 18 this is it then from this 9 i'm going to make a bow starting from here Like this then this was plant is a straight line so when I cut it now you see why I cut out why, what I draw out So this is it. I will notch it here. This is the area that is going to stay at the middle of the back. When you notch it, you know the center. Like this. So this is what we have been talking about. And here is the main dress.
So this is going to stay here. Then you do the bow. So I'm coming. Welcome back. Yeah, the finishing so far. You can see it. You can see the core part. You can see the sleeve. I can see the bow part of it. The way I tie my bow, you can try to tie it anyhow you want it. It could be more finer than mine. So you can see the back. And you can see the front. So thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Like and share. Bye.